Miss Isabella. Miss Isabella. Yes. Mr. Mark is out. Lucky for him. Uh, can I be of assistance, ma'am? Thank you. I have a few old tired mementos to retrieve. These gentlemen are friends of Mr. Mark's from the Vice Squad. Oh, how nice, my favorite squad. I believe I read about you in this morning's paper. Having fun playing Cupid? Oh, shucks, ma'am. It was nothing. Just a little idea of mine that happened to pan out. Oh, I am sorry. But they were flat anyway, weren't they? Stop, darling. My feet hurt. Oh! Oh, you're... Your husband's fiance. How did you get in here? I was just going to ask you the same thing. I live here. Mark and I are married. Really? I adore your negligee. So original. You must show me the rest of your trousseau before you leave. What makes you think I'm leaving? I thought you'd want to spend your honeymoon with the groom, and he's already left. Where is he? If this were my honeymoon, I'd know. Exactly. Mark! Mark! The party's over, Cinderella. I'll see that you get a ticket to Reno and enough cash to make you the belle of Skid Row. Sergeant Hanlon, where's my husband? I don't know, Susie. I mean, uh, Mrs. Christopher. Mrs. Christopher? Well, as Mrs. Christopher, is this my house? Half of it. It's community property. Well, she's standing on my half. Would you kindly throw her out of my half? My father is Senator Rufus D. Alexander. You'll still have to leave. You'll have to carry me out. Hold my cheese sandwich. The senator will have you broken. Ha! Ah, a Democrat. He's got his own troubles. <laughs> Enough of this! Put me down! I can't hear you, lady. I got flat feet. Isabella, what are you doing up there? Wishing I were a Republican. Don't forget this! Put me down, you big oaf! You'll hear about this. Which way to Sun Valley? 